I'm doing a Minecraft mob battle with my friend, but we can spawn horror mobs. For example, if I spawn in this villager and splash it with my horror potion, it'll turn into this super scary clown mob. Oh my gosh, this guy is so creepy. Anyways, Rainy, are you ready to start this horror mob battle? I'm ready, Dash, and you're going down. All right, we'll see about that. Let's begin. All right, guys, so what Rainy doesn't know is that before we started, I secretly set up this one-way glass wall so that I can see exactly what mobs he spawns and spawn in the perfect counter. So for this first round, let's go ahead and see what he's going to be spawning. All right, and it seems like he spawned in a villager, and hmm, I don't know what this is even going to turn into when he splashes it, but I guess we're about to find out. And here we go. And whoa, wait, guys, is that a horror clown thing? Oh my gosh, this thing looks super scary. I did not expect a villager to turn into such a scary mob. I guess Rainy did a good job choosing a villager for his first mob. Well, guys, Rainy's mob over there looks extremely creepy, so we're going to need something extremely scary to take it out. And wait, what is this forest doing here? Why are there trees? And wait, is this some sort of path? Um, hmm, I don't really know what this is, but I guess we'll follow it. Um, this is kind of creepy. I don't know where this leads to. And wait, what is that over there? Is that a portal? Wait, what? Wait, guys, how is this even possible? There's nothing behind it. And then oh, when you go over here, there's like a room. What? Well, I guess let's go through it. Hopefully nothing goes wrong. And wait, guys, look, there's a chest. And wait, there's a sign here as well. And wait, what does this say? Spawn in this scorpion mob? I'm guessing there's a spawn egg in this chest. And oh yeah, there is a black scorpion. Uh, I'm not sure if this is going to be as scary as Rainy's mob, but I guess let's try it. Let's quickly get out of the portal and uh, let's go over here in front of the wall so that we can spawn it in. I really hope this mob is going to be scarier than Rainy's mob. So let's go ahead and spawn it in. And uh, this guy doesn't really look that scary. I mean, he looks kind of scary, but I think Rainy's mob is even scarier. But wait, guys, I forgot. We have to splash it with our horror potion. So let's just go over here and splash it with the potion and let's see what it turns into. And oh my gosh, guys, look at it now. This scorpion looks so much scarier than the one before. And wait, guys, it even made it nighttime. What? That just goes to show how scary this thing is. And wait, what are these? Is it leaving trails of, wait, flesh blocks? Uh, that's pretty creepy. Well, yeah, guys, I think we are definitely gonna be winning this mob battle. And wait, what is Rainy doing with his mob over here? Let's check it out. All right, Mr. Clown, you are a little bit small, so I kind of want to spawn in a bunch more of you. So let me grab your spawn egg. Ah, oh, thank you so much. And now I can spawn in all your brothers. Let's go. Wait a minute. Did Rainy just multiply all of his mobs by getting the spawn egg and spawning in more? Oh, no. Well, if he's gonna do that, then I'm not sure if our one big scorpion thing over here is gonna be able to take them all out. And wait, is he also using a size changing device to make them huge? Okay, we are definitely gonna need to upgrade this guy. Well, for starters, let's go over here and grab our guy spawn egg. And of course, let's go ahead and spawn in a bunch more of him. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so insane. And since Rainy made one of his guys absolutely ginormous, let's also do the same and grab this size changing device. And we can go ahead and set the scale to absolutely massive. And whenever we go ahead and click on one of our mobs, it'll turn huge. Oh my gosh, just look at this thing. Yeah, guys, I don't think there is any shot we are losing this mob battle. Just look at this guy's face. He looks so insane. Oh man, his legs are even sticking through the wall. Hopefully Rainy doesn't notice them. Wait, what in the world? What is this thing? Uh, Dash? Uh, Rainy, what's up? Your mob's kind of sticking through the wall. Oh yeah, uh, he's pretty big, you know? Some of his legs might be sticking through the wall. It's no problem though. You don't have to worry about anything. My goodness, this guy has some girth. Well, anyways, Rainy, are you ready to drop down the walls? I'm so ready. Drop the walls. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, he is huge. And why is his head just a floating dash? Uh, don't worry about it. He, uh, he doesn't really need a neck. But just look at my guy. He is so huge and he is absolutely gonna destroy your army. Wait, no, he just killed my big cloud. No, not Frederick. Let's go. And wait, it looks like my guys are spawning in little minions of themselves. This is so OP. Wait, that's not fair, Dash. This is a one-on-one -on -one mob battle. What is this? And wait, Rainy, you only have like a few guys left. This is gonna be such an easy round for me. Oh, this 
sucks. Hey, but wait, Dash, why is there a whole forest back here? What happened? And why is there a portal? And wait, what in the world is that? Uh, wait, Rainy, why don't you go ahead and go through it? Uh, I'm kind of scared, but okay. Wait, what? Where am I at? Hey, guys, let's quickly cover up the portal so we can't get out. And perfect. <laughs> wait, I'm stuck inside of here. I'm super claustrophobic. Get me out. Okay, I'll let you out, Rainy. <laughs> you just got pranked. Oh, you're lucky. I was about to blow up this whole place to get out. Well, anyways, Rainy, I think all of your guys just died. So I guess that's a GG's for me. Oh, man. Let's move on to the next round. All right, guys. Well, that first round went super well. We absolutely destroyed Rainy. Luckily, this forest came in clutch and helped us choose the correct mob. Well, anyways, now that it's the next round, let's see what mob Rainy's gonna spawn. And wait, did Rainy just spawn in some sort of weird Steve looking thing? What in the world is this? Yeah, this guy does not really look scary at all. Uh, I'm curious to see what it'll turn into when Rainy splashes it. And here we go. And wait, guys, did it just turn into Hero Brian? Oh no, guys, this is not good. This thing looks extremely OP. Well, guys, Hero Brian is like one of the most OP mobs in the entire game. So we're gonna need something extremely creepy and powerful to counter it. Hmm, maybe if we go through the forest again, there will be another sign and a chest that tells us what we need to spawn. So let's go check it out. All right, here is the portal. And wait, guys, I think the portal got this destroyed. Oh no, this is not good. How are we gonna know what mob to spawn in now? Well, wait, I actually think I might know what we can use to counter Hero Brian. So there is this one mob called the Mogler, and it's kind of just like some OP lava mob. Let me just spawn one in and show you guys. And there it is. Look at this thing. I mean, this guy already looks pretty creepy as is. Look at him. He's like shaking, and he's got three eyes. But now, let's see what he's gonna turn into when we splash it with the horror potion. And oh my gosh, what in the world? He just became so massive. What the heck? This guy is taller than all of the trees in the forest. This guy is insane. And wait, I think he might even be taller than the glass wall. And oh my gosh, wait, he's sticking his head through the wall. What in the world is this thing? Dad! Uh, Rainy, what's up? Get your stupid mob from coming on my side. He's breaking through the wall. Uh, oh, I'm sorry about that. He was just, uh, curious. He wanted to see what was popping on your side. Well, I don't care. The next time he's too curious, I'm gonna beat him up. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. He's literally on Rainy side. And wait, what in the world is Rainy doing? Is he building some sort of shrine for his hero, Brian? Uh, this is kind of weird. And it looks like he used the size changing device again to make his hero, Brian absolutely huge. Well, guys, we still do have a few minutes before the walls drop, and this seems like a perfect opportunity to go and prank Rainy. Except, hmm, what type of prank should we pull on Rainy this time? Wait, I know. We can build a portal over here that connects to Rainy's side. And then we can drop TNT through our portal that'll land on Rainy's hero brand shrine. So using these portal blocks, let's just go ahead and make a little portal just like this. And now we can go ahead and light it. And oh my gosh, look guys, now we have a portal that goes over to Rainy's side. And I'm pretty sure the portal over here is invisible, so Rainy can't even tell that we're spying on him. Well anyways, now that we've got a direct portal over to Rainy's hero brand shrine, what should we do? So for starters, let's just go ahead and grab a normal TNT and let's build a little mount over here so that we can light it and then drop it right before it's gonna blow up. And let's put down our TNT, light it, and release. Let's see what happens. Oh my gosh, we just blew up Rainy's shrine. Wait, what in the world? No, someone broke the shrine. This means Lord Herobrine's gonna escape. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. Well, that normal TNT did a little bit of damage to his shrine. So uh, I think we're gonna have to step it up a notch because we're gonna need to blow up this shrine entirely because I'm pretty sure it's making Herobrine more powerful by the second. And, hmm, which TNT should we use? Because there's a lot of TNTs in this mod pack. Well, why don't we go ahead and test out the Spear TNT, and then after, we can do a bunch of the other ones. So, let's just go ahead and put one over here, and let's light it, and release. Let's see what it does. And, oh my gosh, guys, it just blew up his shrine completely. What in the world? Why does my shrine keep blowing up? I'm so sorry. Sad. Oh no, guys, I think we made Rainy super sad. Well, now I'm starting to feel bad. Hmm, well, I do actually know a way that we can make him feel better. There's this one TNT in the game called the Brick House TNT. And basically, whenever it blows up, it just spawns in a huge brick house. So why don't we light one of these off and give Rainy a free brick house? So let's just light it and release. Here we go, here we go. And there it is. This house looks pretty cool. And oh, I think we released it a little bit too late because it's kind of floating in 
in the air. Wait, what in the world was that noise? Is this the house? Why is there a house on my side? Well, I guess this is pretty cool. Let me just build a staircase up to it. And it looks like we made Rainy happy again. This is so epic. Well, anyways, I think we are definitely still gonna win the mob battle because just look at this guy. He is absolutely ginormous compared to Rainy's little hero, Brian. And it looks like Rainy's making good use of his house. I'm glad to see that. Well, anyways, Rainy, are you ready to drop down the walls? I'm ready. Let's do it. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's see this. Oh my gosh, Dash, your guy is huge. Yep, my guy is absolutely massive. There is no way we are losing to your little hero, Brian guy over here. Oh, this isn't good. Come on, come on. Here we go. My guy is about to notice your guy and then it's going to be over. Oh, and it looks like they're about to fight and it looks like your guy is taking a lot of damage. And wait, it seems like he's hitting my mob. What? And wait, Rainy, I think your hero, Brian, is riding my mob. What is going on here? Wait, what is he doing? What? Oh man, this is so perfect. He's not even fighting him, but he's still taking a bunch of damage. Your guy is definitely getting low. There is no way he's winning this. Oh no, this isn't good. And Rainy, I think your guy just died. GG's. Oh man, that sucks. That round was too easy. And wait, is there another portal on your side, Dash? What in the world does this one do? Oh, uh, don't worry about this. It's just, uh, I, I don't wait, know. It, it just uh, randomly popped up. Wait, why can I see myself, Dash? Why can I see myself? That's scary. What? Uh, Rainy, this is just a mirror. Don't worry about <laughs> it. Oh no, that portal's scary. I'm going back into my house. Phew, good thing Rainy got scared and ran off. He didn't find out what this was. Well, anyways, let's move on to the next round. All right, guys. Well, that last round went super well. That portal came in clutch. We absolutely destroyed Rainy's mob. Well, anyways, now that it's the next round, of course, using our one-way glass, let's see what Rainy's up to. All right, well, Dash is using a lot of portals, so I want to make this super cool portal and go to the horror dimension so I can get horror mobs and completely destroy Dash. Wait, he's building a portal that goes to the horror dimension and he's going to get absolutely scary horror mobs? Oh, no. Well, let's see what this portal turns into. And whoa, guys, wait, I can't believe that actually worked. And whoa, what is that dimension? It must actually be the horror dimension. Oh, man, this portal looks super scary. We definitely have to go in and check it out. And it looks like Rainy's about to go in and whoa, that looks super scary. Well, we definitely have to follow Rainy to see what he's up to. So let's quickly grab a potion of invisibility and let's head over onto his side. All right, so now we're on Rainy's side and let's just quickly go over here through his portal before he gets away. And let's just go through and whoa, here we are. And where did the portal go? Uh, guys, uh, this is not good. I don't think there's any return portal. Oh no, I guess let's quickly follow Rainy. Maybe he knows where to go. Oh no, Rainy is super far away. Hopefully I don't lose him. We've been running for so long. I'm kind of getting tired and wait, it's that a house? Um, wait, what is Rainy doing? Is he about to go inside? All right, here we are. Hopefully, Rainy can't see us because we are invisible after all. Bob, your door is open. Oh, silly me. Uh, Rainy, you can definitely come inside. Come on. Wait, is he talking to Bob? Wait, what can he be doing with Bob? I haven't seen you in so long, Bob, but I really need your help right now. How can I help you out, Rainy? Well, my friend is kind of cheating in this Bob battle right now. I need an extra scary mob from the horror dimension in order to beat him. Well, I can definitely get you a super scary mob. Oh, thank you so much, Bob. Let me just... Whip it up, and here you go. Oh, perfect. Thank you so much, Bob. I always appreciate you. Whoa, wait, guys. Bob just gave Rainy a cool mob spawn egg. I wonder what mob that could be. Well, I guess let's follow Rainy to find out. Oh, man, there's no way Dash is gonna beat me now. And since there's really no return portal bat, I guess I can use my super cool rocket to get back. Wait, he's using a rocket to get back because there's no return portal? Oh, no. And this should only take about five minutes, so I'm hoping Dash doesn't realize I'm gone. Oh, no, guys. This isn't good. How am I gonna get back home? I don't have a rocket. Well, I do still have a few of these portal blocks from last round, so maybe I can try building a portal that'll take us back to the arena. Let's quickly go over here where Rainy won't be able to see us, and let's quickly build a portal. All right, here we go. I really hope this works. And now let's just go ahead and light it. And come on, did it work? And whoa, guys, look, I think it worked. This is going back over to our side. Look, I can see the one-way glass and everything. And wait, what was that noise? Oh, wait, Rainy's rocket is taking off. Hopefully he doesn't see us and okay he's far away enough i think we're good well let's quickly go over here through our portal and perfect we are back home oh man that portal was so epic we made it home before rainy and hmm rainy did say that his rocket was gonna take like five minutes so why don't we go over to his side and prank him while he's gone all right so here we are and we don't even have to be invisible because rainy's on a rocket and hmm we've got a lot of time what type of prank should we do wait a minute i know what if we go over here 
underneath this platform and put a bunch of TNT down and then connect it to a lever on our side that'll let us activate it when the walls drop. Oh man, this is gonna be so funny. So first, of course, let's go ahead and clear out a ginormous area that we can put our TNT in. There we go. Now that we've got a big hole, we can start laying down the TNT. Well, since we want this explosion to be absolutely ginormous, let's use some TNT times five. And let's also go ahead and scatter in some TNT times 20s in there as well. Oh man, this is gonna be such a funny prank. Rainy's gonna have no idea what's happening. Let's also go ahead and put in a few TNT times 20s here. And we're only gonna put a few because TNT times 20 is extremely powerful. And now let's go ahead and using a lever, connect some redstone from our side all the way to the TNT so that we can activate it from our side. Here we go and perfect. And now we can go ahead and just cover everything up. And just like that, our trap is complete. And the best part is you can't even tell that it's a trap. Well, anyways, let's quickly run back over to our side because Rainy is probably gonna be landing any second now. And whoa, guys, it looks like Rainy just landed. That was perfect timing. Well, anyways, now that he's back, we can see what type of mob Bob gave him. And whoa, wait, is that the mob? This thing looks insane. And wait, did Rainy just make him huge as well? Oh no. And whoa, guys, look at his face. It's like a warden head. Oh no, this must mean he has warden powers. This guy is probably gonna be super powerful. And wait, is Rainy spawning in even more of them? Oh no, this is not good, guys. Well, I don't think our TNT is gonna be enough to kill all of Rainy's mobs, so we're gonna have to spawn in a mob of our own. And I think I know exactly what type of mob we should use to counter this. So everyone knows the mob pillager. It's, you know, it's like a villager, but it has a crossbow. But what will happen if we splash it with our horror potion? Let's find out. So let's just splash it a few times and... Oh my gosh, wait, what is this? Is this what a horror pillager looks like? And wait, what? I think the pillager's crossbow got upgraded into these two ray guns. Oh man, this guy looks insane. We have to test out some of his attacks against the zombies. So let's just go ahead and spawn one down and see what he does. And oh my gosh, wait, what? His ray guns are so OP. It just like two-shotted him. Well, yeah, guys, I think we are definitely winning this round again. And we've also got the TNT. So, you know, 100% winning. Well, hmm, it seems like Rainy is spawning in quite a few of his guys. And I'm not sure if this one guy is gonna be enough to take them out. So I guess let's go ahead and grab his spawn egg and spawn in a bunch more. And there we go. Oh my gosh, we've got so many of these guys now. We are definitely not losing this round. Well, anyways, Rainy, are you ready to drop down the walls? Yep, I'm ready. Let's do it. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's see this. And guys, let's quickly go over here and activate our TNT and let's see what happens. Whoa, what are these things, Sassy? They're so scary. Uh, Rainy, don't worry about it. I think you have a bigger problem on your hands. Wait, what do you mean? Uh, why don't you look at your mobs? Wait, what did everything just blow up? What just happened? Oh my gosh, this is going so perfectly. Rainy, I may have set up a TNT trap on your side. What? That's so not fair. And wait, Rainy, I think it just killed all of your mobs back here. That was so insane. Oh, no. And it looks like you've only got one guy left, and I've still got, like, 60. And here we go, Rainy. They're about to start fighting. Come on, come on. Come on, my guy can definitely win. You know what, Rainy? Just to make it fair, I'm gonna get rid of a few of my guys to make it so that it's just a 1v1. Let's go. I'm just gonna do this to show how OP my guys are. And now that there's only two guys left, let's see who wins. Here we go, Rainy. They're fighting. Let's see who wins this. Come on, my guy. I can definitely win this. He's super strong. There is no way. Just look at my guy. Look how much damage he's doing. And GG's. Ah, uh, GG. Let's move on to the next round. Well, Dash, if you're building those stupid TNT traps, I'm gonna build my own. You're gonna build a TNT trap this round? Well, I bet it's not gonna be nearly as good as mine. Anyways, let's begin. All right, guys. So it's the next round. And Rainy said that he's gonna build some sort of TNT trap on his side as well. But first, let's see what mob he's gonna be spawning. And wait, did he just spawn in a map? Magma cube. Wait, that thing is so small. What is this gonna turn into? Well, I guess we're about to find out. And oh my gosh. Wait, what in the world is this? This thing looks pretty insane. I did not expect a magma cube to turn into this. This guy looks so powerful. It's like some weird moving block sort of thing. Uh, it does look pretty scary though, so we're gonna need a cool counter. Well, if Rainy wants to play with cube mobs, then why don't we go ahead and spawn in a slime? Because slimes are pretty much also just big cubes. And there we go. Look at this guy. I don't really have any idea what this is gonna turn into, but let's go ahead and splash it and find out. And oh my gosh, wait guys, what in the world is this? It's like some sort of slime insect. What? This thing looks absolutely insane. Look, it's got this ginormous slime cube.
cube over here and just look at his face. This guy looks so creepy. There is no way we're losing. I'm kind of curious what this guy's attacks are. So let's go ahead and spawn in another zombie and see what type of damage it does. And here we go. They're about to start fighting. And wait, is he shooting slime balls? What? This guy is so cool. And look, it just like two shot in the zombie. That is so epic. Well, yeah, guys, there's no question about it. We are definitely winning this round. And anyways, what is Rainy doing over here? All right, let's just finish doing our TNT cannon. Something like this. And of course, we have to add in the TNT. Wait, is Rainy building a TNT cannon to try to take out our army? Oh, no. Well, TNT cannons are actually pretty OP. So we have to stop this. Let's quickly grab a potion of invisibility and let's head over onto his side. All right, guys, here we are. And let's see how his TNT cannon works. All right, it looks like a pretty simple TNT cannon, but I'm pretty sure if we just get rid of the water, the entire thing will explode. So let's just quickly grab a bucket and right when Rainy's about to test it, we can pull the water. All right, let's go ahead and test this by hitting this button and boom. Let's quickly take the water and guys, let's see what happens. And it just all exploded. <laughs> what in the world? Where did my water just go? Oh, I spent so much time on that cannon. Now it's all destroyed. I guess I'll just get some more materials to build a new one for my house. Oh my gosh, that was so funny. And wait, did he say he's getting materials from his house to build another one? Okay, guys, while he's in his chest, we have to pull some sort of crazy prank on him. And wait, guys, I have a perfect idea. So you know how we've been building a lot of portals this mob battle? Well, why don't we build a portal at Rainy's door that takes him to the void? So that when Rainy goes out of his house and through the door, he'll fall straight into the void. So let's just go ahead and grab some portal blocks and place them over here just like that. And let's also light our portal. And there we go. And oh my gosh, look guys, now we have a portal that goes directly into the void. Let's go over here through one of Rainy's windows and see what it looks like from the inside. And oh my gosh, guys, this is so perfect. It just looks normal from the inside. But once you actually go through, it's too late. Well, anyways, I guess now we just have to wait for Rainy to finish getting his materials. And wait, guys, it looks like he just finished with his chest. Now he's about to go through the door. Let's see this. Perfect. We got all of our materials. Let's just go in. What in the world is happening? Why am I falling? Wait, what is this portal in front of my house? What is this thing? Oh my gosh, this is so funny. It looks like he found the portal. Let's quickly go back over to our side before he thinks that it's us. Well, anyways, Rainy, are you ready to drop down the walls? I'm ready. Let's do it. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's see this. What in the world is this thing, Dash? Rainy, this is my slime monster. Just look at him. He looks so OP. Ew, this is so gross. Well, it's definitely gonna beat your OP magma cube thing. We'll see about that. Wait, how did you know it was a magma cube? Oh, well, uh, I kind of just had the feeling. I kind of just had a feeling. Um, okay, I guess. Well, anyways, Rainy, it looks like they're about to start fighting. This is about to be insane. Oh, no, come on. My guy has to win this. Uh, wait, I think my guy is fighting some sort of fly thing over here. Wait, my guy isn't too smart. What is he doing here? He's probably super scared of my guy because he's super strong. Uh, actually, I think he's just warming up. And wait, Rainy, it looks like your guy is coming towards my mob. They're about to start fighting. Here we go. And wait, did your guy just turn invisible? What in the world? Oh, here we go, Rainy. The battle is really on. Let's see who's gonna win. Come on, my guy's definitely gonna win. Here we go, here we go. And wait, did my guy just die? Ha <laughs> ha, I'm so much better. My guy's too OP. Okay, Rainy, well, don't get cocky yet. You just won one round. And I'm not gonna take it easy on you in the next round. So let's move on to that. All right, guys, it's the next round. And we kind of just lost the last round. So we can't let that happen again. We have to win this one. So of course, let's see what Rainy's gonna be spawning this time. And wait, it seems like he just spawned in a creeper. Wait, this is actually gonna probably turn into something super scary. Oh no, let's see what it turns into. Oh my gosh, did it just turn into a robot creeper? Oh man, this guy looks pretty powerful. Well, I didn't think it was gonna have to come to this, but since we have to win this mob battle, we're gonna have to use our secret weapon. We're gonna be spawning in Godzilla. And Godzilla is basically just like a baby version of Godzilla. And once we splash it with our horror potion, it's gonna turn absolutely OP. So let's just go over here and splash it a few times and let's see what it turns into. And oh my gosh, what in the world is this? This thing looks insane. And wait, is it already shooting fireballs everywhere already? What in the world? Oh no, look, it's trying to break the wall. Oh my gosh, this guy is absolutely insane. He is shooting stuff all over the place. And look at his face. 
this guy looks so scary. I think it turned into some sort of robot Godzilla. This thing is insane. Well, anyway, since we're definitely gonna win this round, let's just ask Rainy if he wants to drop the walls. Rainy, are you ready to drop down the walls? I'm ready. Let's do it. All right, Rainy, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's do it. Oh my gosh, is that Godzilla? Yes, it is. And wait, I think it just one-shotted your creeper thing. Wait, no. Wait, did you just spawn in more? That's not fair. Well, I mean, it's fine. My guy cannot die. He's like invincible. Come on, creepers. Come on. Oh my gosh, this is such an easy round. Well, anyways, Rainy, I guess I win that round. Oh, man. If you enjoyed that video, make sure to hit like and subscribe and click on one of the videos on the screen if you want to watch more.